How's it going, ladies and gentlemen, on YouTube? I am Ultimate Speedway, and I'm back at it with another video. Today, I'm going to be reviewing William Byron's Exalted Diecast. So, I'm going to pause the video and take the diecast out. The diecast is out. Okay, sorry about that. On the hood, we have Exalta, and then Chevy Camaro. 24 Exalta Cup Series Valvoline in Liberty University. And then Exalta Coding Systems Chevy Camaro. And there's the other side. And then the top we have 24. Then we have Byron and Exalta. Overall, I really love this scheme. When this first came out, I did not like this scheme one bit, and I think many other people were in the same boat as me, where they thought that this scheme was hideous. And, yeah, and now I saw it out on the track, and I fell in love with this scheme. I would say this is one that's definitely up to you, um, on whether or not you want to get it. Hold on, let me... So I did not buy last year's Exalted Eyecast. So I'm going to do a side-by-side -side comparison with two years ago version as I make a mess. These are die casts I got autographed at Watkins Glen. As you can sort of see, but I can zoom out. There you go. So I'm going to do a side-by-side -side comparison with the two seasons ago Exalta. If I can fix this. There we go. So the colors are definitely different, as you guys could tell. So rather than flames, we get stripes on the side. And then really, the backs are exactly the same, except for different colors. Really, it's just replacing flames with stripes. That's the big difference, and the hood's basically the same except for different colors and this primary color was blue and this one was red but yeah no overall i would say definitely buy this one unless you do not like the scheme i feel this scheme was really hated when exalta first released it and now it's like one of the most loved schemes i loved watching the scheme cross the finish line at homestead to win it Yeah, no, definitely pick this one up. I feel like it's probably going to be gone soon just because of how loved it's been. And I probably will be getting the Homestead Race version because I want to keep up with the Byron schemes because Byron's my third favorite, second or third favorite. I'd say right now it's Larson, Byron, Chastain, Eric Jones, Bowman Blaney. Something like that. But let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of this die cast. Me personally, I would give it a solid 9 out of 10. <clears throat> I honestly hated this scheme when it first came out. I despised the scheme and then I saw it out on the track and I fell in love with the scheme. And I feel many people were the same way as me. And it just shows, don't judge a book by its cover. Oh, we got an error there. But let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of this die cast. And as of always, comment, like, and subscribe. Hit that bell so you never miss a thing. I am Ultimate Speedway, and I am signing out. Peace.